on the 2003 Ford Ranger, 2.3 liter, four cylinder. We're doing the radiator. When you're doing it also, there's uh, this plastic thing you should transfer. It's got three pins on it. Just remove them and put it on the new radiator. I'm actually at the point put the new radiator in. And one of my videos went missing. This is a manual transmission. But you can see the where the fittings would be for your uh, automatic transmission fluid. You have to take uh, this line off and then one down there as well. But luckily I don't have to because it's a manual. And we have our power steering here. Just uh, three 10 millimeter bolts. They're out of the way right now. There's the bolts right there. And the fan shroud just lifted off the two fittings that are built into the radiator. You got that clamp off there. I think that shows everything that you need to do the radiator in your Ford Ranger. lift this right out. Well, I could probably videotape that way except you can laugh because I forgot to undo the lower radiator hose. Right down there is the hose where I get to it with the type of clamps on here. There's a special tool for it of course. I have notched some pliers here they work pretty well. Usually you can get up with a pair of pliers or a small pair of uh, channel locks. So we'll just take that lower hose off and then uh, we'll lift up the radiator and pull it out. So here's what you'll see underneath the truck. Assuming it's the same as mine. I got that hose disconnected and we can now lift the uh, radiator hose out. to it. You can see the drain there, right there. You can see the slots. Alright, good luck to you.